commence our meeting today, <laughs> this being a special meeting of the Board of Directors of the Woodland Davis Clean Water Agency, it being Tuesday, October 15, 2019, and it is now 8.05. Uh, <coughs> the agenda will, uh, is there any item to be added to the agenda today? Okay. The record will reflect that all regular members of the agency are present. Uh, with the exception of, of Director Saylor. And um, this is now a time for public comment. Will, does your son have anything he'd like to say today? <laughs> All right. All right. There being no public comment, we will proceed to the considerable business we have before us today. Item one is to consider approval of the CEQA Environmental Impact Report, addendum number 10, and make related findings concerning proposed option agreement for sale of water with the City of West Sacramento. And Tim, are you presenting the item? Uh, yes, yes, this is the uh, pretty much an identical EIR addendum that the board approved a year ago. Uh, this is to support the water purchase agreement with West Sacramento. Um, Kind of one of the reasons for the special board meeting is today is that West Sacramento would be using, if, if approved, uh, this environmental document would be used for West Sacramento's approval of the purchase agreement as well. So they're not doing their own CEQA document, they're relying on ours. Um, basically, it's simply uh, approving the transfer of water from West Sacramento to the agency. We're both in Sacramento River, their intake is roughly five miles downstream of ours, so there's really no impact of any kind with this transfer. All right, are there questions of any member of the the board. All right, then let's have a motion. I'll move approval. Second. Is there a requirement of a public hearing on this? Uh, no. All right. We have a motion uh, and a second to approve the uh, the addendum number 10 to the CEQA EIR. All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? Motion carries. I item two is the main, uh, main uh, item for the day, and that is to consider approval of the option agreement for sale of water with the City of West Sacramento for the purchase of up to 2,000 acre feet of supplemental water. Uh, Tim. Hi, uh, thank you. Um, yeah, this is a very, again, a very similar agreement to the one that was approved by the board a year ago. Uh, for your consideration, today is an option agreement for the purchase of up to 2,000 acre feet of water uh, for the months of November and December. Uh, the option agreement includes payment of the first 1,000 acre feet up, up front, exactly what we did last year at $50 an acre foot. Um, I think that this is a good insurance policy for the agency. I, I think the risk of Term 91 curtailment this year is less than it was a year ago. Um, but last year, the Term 91 ended October 26. It was reimposed November 15 until November 30. So I think there is some risk that Term 91 could happen, although I think the risk is lower. So I feel this is a good insurance policy for the agency to have in case we need it. And then the other reason I, I feel is important is that it does continue the relationship with West Sacramento for pur purchasing of water. When it's available to us. And did you say we, we have to buy a minimum of a, of a thousand acre feet, but we could buy up to two thousand acre feet? Correct. Yeah. And yeah. The, the contract includes a payment of fifty thousand dollars initially, and that covers the first thousand acre feet. And then if we use more than that, then we would pay whatever we use. All right. But if there's no, but if we don't ever become subject to term ninety one can tell. Can, What's the word? Uh, curtailment. curtailment. Yeah. Can, uh, containment was not a word. I knew that. Uh, it, and but that purchase happens. We just put it through our regular system, or what? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Essentially, it would be a fifty thousand dollars insurance policy if we did not exercise that option. Okay. Thank well, you. last year we used about, around nine hundred acre feet of the water in, okay. in two weeks' time. Thanks. Uh, additional questions. Yes. But would Rich. the fifty thousand dollars be held over the next year if we didn't use it? No, no, it would not be. We're, it, it's in other words, it's either water or an option to have water. <laughs> yes, we're paying for it. <laughs> we we're paying for. Do we pay and then use zero, or do we just take what we paid for and just use it? Uh, what what happens is. What happened last year is that they will send us an invoice for $50,000, we would pay that. And then if term 91 is, is imposed, we would use whatever water we need up to 2,000 acre feet of water. Anything over 1,000 acre feet, we would pay that, pay that amount. But say we never need it, we never become subject to term 91, then do we still get that 1,000 acre feet of water? Y yes, we can. And that's, that's one strategy that we have for firming up their demand. 
uh, to kind of proving to CVP that that water right is actually used, we can report it as that the agency took and used that water. I mean, if we paid yes. for it, we may as well drink it, right? Yes, and that, that can be <laughs> beneficial to West Sacramento in that it, it does firm up their demand. There you go, thanks, appreciate it. Yes, and as I understand it, the reason for doing this is because we don't want to use untreated well water even though it's available to us. It'll produce other costs and inconveniences to our ratepayers. Yeah, yes, exactly. If, if Term 91 were to be imposed without this agreement in place, uh, the cities and UC Davis would immediately have to go back to well water, uh, 100%. And we, the agency would still be paying for operations of the water treatment plant. However, we wouldn't be receiving water from them uh, for the duration. And there are cost implications to what untreated well water does to our piping systems, is there not? Yes. Yeah, so the cities would have to go back to untreated well water. We would chlorinate, the cities would chlorinate the water, UC Davis would chlorinate the water. Um, but particularly in Woodland, we had some negative impacts uh, with a pretty stark difference in water chemistry between the surface water and the treated groundwater. Um, the pipes could be okay with that for a short period of time, but if it, go to, if it goes on for too long, we could have some rather negative impacts, especially in Woodland. Good. Colleagues? Uh, I don't have any questions, thanks. All right. A uh, motion would be happy. I'll make entertain. a motion to uh, approve this item. Thank you. Mo motion by Director Lee, seconded by Director Landsberg, that we uh, proceed to purchase 2,000 acre feet of water uh, from the city of West Sacramento at a price of $50,000, at least for the initial 1,000 uh, mm -hmm. acre feet. Further discussion? There being none, all in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? Motion carried. <coughs> Well, long range board calendar. Uh, Do we still have that Halloween meeting? It's on, it's on right now as kind of a tentative, tentative meeting. Uh, if, if we needed to have the meeting, we would have it, but I think we're waiting to hear back for some uh, additional information at this time. Yeah. Yeah, let's, let's hang loose a bit for that. For that. All right, ju just so you know, I have an 8.30 meeting in Sacramento that day, so are we scheduled to start at 7.30? At 7.30, yes. Yeah. So. Uh, hopefully we could do it in half an hour, but we'll see. All right, um, any board member comments? Camille? No. Brett? Rich? No, thank you. And I have none either. Thank you everybody for getting up early. Thank you, Elena, Elena and for uh, putting together the meeting. Uh, and we, I think that concludes us. We, I think we were promised we'd be done by 8.15. We're done by 8.15, the meeting is adjourned. <laughs> yeah.